In the following story from the files of the West Virginia State Police, Trooper Scott Moore faces a dangerous escaped convict with a deadly arsenal. Trooper Moore portrays himself in our reenactment. Hey, clear. 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 Yeah, go ahead. Wayne Ellison was sentenced to life in prison in 1981 for first degree murder. Now he suddenly Done. developed a green thumb. It's done. It's done. Let's go. Come on, Wayne. Get out. Allison and his friends are using their time in the nursery to try and dig their way out of prison. Digging 12 feet underground, they've broken through to a sewer tunnel, leading them under the prison walls. Allison, who's escaped before, wants to stay out this time. Once they're in the clear, the convicts split up and go their separate ways. Wayne Allison, on the run, has been casing the neighborhood and breaks into the home of an elderly couple. I don't know. Let's go wake up your wife. That's too tight. Shut up. Trooper Scott Moore of the West Virginia State Police is about ready to go home. Moore always wanted to be a policeman. His two great uncles were in the FBI. The fugitive leaves the couple tied up in their own bedroom, steals their car and their guns, and makes his getaway. Later that morning, the couple struggles free and calls police, and a bulletin is sent out on the fugitive. 304-104 Corporal Robert McComas of the West Virginia State Police and Corporal Richard Green, alerted by a toll booth operator, wait for the stolen car to reach them. An escape murderer with stolen weapons goes up against the West Virginia State Police when we come back. An escaped murderer steals an arsenal of weapons and ties up the owners before taking their car. West Virginia State Police try a rolling roadblock to stop the man, but with temperatures well below zero and the roads covered with ice, the chase is unusually dangerous for the troopers as the pursuit reaches speeds of over 80 miles an hour. Concerned about skidding off the highway, the troopers start to close in cautiously on the fugitive's car. searched the car afterwards, he had a uh, loaded 44 Magnum on the seat beside of him. I think if there had only been one of us, or possibly two, that there would have been a uh, all-out firefight uh, trying to apprehend him. The convict was found guilty of armed robbery and given another 40 years in prison. The other escapees were later captured in Oklahoma after committing an armed robbery. Corporal Green is now a sergeant stationed in Lewisburg. Trooper Moore has been promoted to Trooper First Class, still patrolling the same area. 